row does. And I come in here and try and be as quiet as possible. While I get my day started, I'm gonna hop in the shower. Maybe I'll be a little bit more talkative after that. All right, well, I feel a little bit better now. Ah, I'm getting there. After a quick shower, I'm trying to do my thing quietly while Rose stays sleeping, which might be for quite some time. Just one thing, being out here in the desert, everything is dry. I need to get a little extra lotion. Try to keep it simple. I definitely appreciate at this point having my own men's grooming products. Thing is that when I was still in prison, I couldn't get lotion, nose hair trimmers, <laughs> things that you didn't even realize you you missed until you had them. Strangely enough, dental floss. Dental floss is something that is considered a security risk if you're in any higher custody prisons because I guess more than once guys have used dental floss to saw through bars. Now, I've never tried it myself, but I can only imagine how long something like that might take. Dental floss, really? Having this good dental floss that Ro turned me on to. What is this? Oral-B mint flavor. That really does. It's so nice to have it. Especially since I haven't been to a dentist probably eight years, seven years, long time, toothpaste. It's like a, it's a clay. It's really helped cleaning my teeth, especially since I drank a lot of coffee. And an electric toothbrush makes life so much easier. It's definitely a hundred times better than a regular toothbrush. It took me a minute to get used to. It's all the little things that I really appreciate. And the big things, contacts. I went for over 20 years using glasses and I was never comfortable in them. And it took me absolutely no time at all to get comfortable using contacts. One more thing. A little something for the hair. Uh, well, it's just a little bit. That's about it. So, now the easy part is over. Time to go make breakfast. But on our way out, we're gonna take a peek and see uh, see how Rose is doing. Absolute must. Keurigs didn't exist when I went in. It was one of the first things I discovered when I got out. Definitely helps starting the day. So, this is a normal routine. powder, chia seeds, and for me, some of this keto nutso butter, which is absolutely phenomenal. And it sure beats prison, commissary, kefi, peanut butter, which I stopped eating years ago. Not only is this much more healthy, it tastes a whole lot better. So now that I've got this set up and I can take Rose, bowl, cover hers, set her up with a cup of coffee for whenever she's ready, whenever she gets up. What we got up here? Some vitamin D. And we've got some fish oil. Once we have breakfast, we'll out of here. Ideally, come out onto the patio. You know. 
beautiful morning out here. Got my coffee, got my breakfast. I sit down, open up my laptop. You know, take a few moments to really just stop, enjoy breathing, and uh, appreciate uh, the incredible life that we're leading right now. Very, very grateful. Where are you? Over here. <laughs> That was rough, but we just finished our early morning warm up slash workout, pre workout. We try to get in a second one, although we haven't been that great at it. So now we're off to mm -hmm. do our prison food versus healthy food cook off. Who's gonna win? This girl. This isn't a typical weekday morning routine, it's a weekend routine, but we are blessed with having a drug test for Adam this morning. So we're gonna eat. We're gonna head out, do the drug test, and then get in the second part of our workout, which includes pull-ups and some conditioning or something like that. So thank you for following along on our morning routine. Wanna say anything else for you? No. Just gonna stand here and look gorgeous? I will let the results speak for themselves. Oh, on that. Because everybody knows who's gonna win the cook-off, right? Me. We have some taste testers who might be coming over, we think, right? Because obviously we're both gonna vote for our own, mm -hmm. duh. Unless I blow him away with mine is gonna happen. All right, you guys, we love you. If you're interested in a video where Adam called into his probation office right there in real time with you guys, click that video there. If you're not already subscribed, we'd love to have you join the family by clicking that circle there or the red box below. We love you guys and we'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.